Hello everyone, so I'm back with another video. This will be a short video. I wanted to introduce the latest release from Iron Orchid. We were just given the go-ahead to be able to release this and show this to the public. So I do have a limited stock ready to ship. I have it in inventory ready to ship and I do plan on doing another order based on sales, but I wanted to show you the amazing products that they've come out for uh, this winter. Okay, so I thought I would start by showing you the molds. And last year they came out with two, it was Boughs of Holly and a Snowflake one, and they both sold out really quick. And so uh, if you see these and you're liking them and wanting them, Again, I do have limited availability and in inventory right now. I wasn't sure how much to purchase. So uh, if you did place this, chances are you'd get this shipped out right away. And then I could always do another order for more if I sell out. But these did go very quickly last year. And I wasn't even able to order more to meet the demand because they were so popular. They did come out with one similar to Bows of Holly. It's called Holly Lane. And it's got the pine cone. Irma Holly, it's really pretty. And there you can kind of see how, you know, it would look. But I, I do plan on, depending upon if I'm able to even get one for myself, <laughs> I'm going to sell what I have on stock first, and then if I can get more and create with them, I'm going to have some fun with them. So there's that one. This one, I have a feeling this one's gonna go so quick. Uh, this one is called Blitz, and it's snowflakes, and I think I actually like these ones better than the last ones. These ones look like they'll be easier to pop up from the mold. I did have a little trouble with the last snowflake mold that they came out with. It was gorgeous. It was beautiful. I did a video showing how I used those, but this is just stunning. Look at how pretty. And... So again, depending upon if I'm able to keep one for myself and they don't all sell out, I will definitely be doing something with this mold for sure. And the other one I really like as well, well actually I like all of them. This one is called Bobbles, so it's these ornaments. I think these are so neat. So you could take and make these and then place them over you know, those plastic ornaments that you see at Dollar Tree or something similar to that and just really create gorgeous ornaments. So I really think that this would be fun to work with as well. And then the last mold that they came out with, and I love, love, love this one. Have a feeling this one's gonna go really quick too because deer are so popular. It's called Jingle. It's got these deer in here. Oh God, I love this one. I just love it. And there you can kind of see a little preview. So I got it upside down of how that would look. I think this one's gonna go really fast too. So again, if you love making uh, clay pieces with the molds, I would grab these quick. I just have a feeling that these are gonna go really, really fast even through iron orchid i mean once they sell out that's it they don't they don't bring them back i've asked i've, I've contacted them a couple times and said are you sure you can't bring these back because i have so many requests for the boughs of holly and the snowflake one that they did a few years ago and they said that they do not bring them back so once these are gone they're gone and if you have a chance to get them boy i would grab them while you can so there's the molds. Now for the stamps. Oh, I love the stamps too. This one is my favorite that they've released. And this is called Cozy. I think that this would be so much fun. Can you imagine you stamp this out and you create a really cute shaker card with this? I think it would be so cute. And then you could, you know, stamp out your sentiment there's so many things you could do here. They have uh, the tea bag to go with the teacup, and then you have this sweater pattern, so you could do wrapping paper, you could do really cool tags. And there they did some wall art, and you can see the wrapping 
paper that they did here as well and they did a tag with the sentiment. I have a feeling this one's going to go quick as well. Love it. I love it. So there's that one. And then this one is fun too. I love this bow. I just love this bow. But these are uh, all plaid designs. It's called Pretty and Plaid. Here they took some fabric and they created a pillow and then you have fabric for the, like the gnome hats here. And then they made a really pretty bow that you could use for presents or like home decor, whatever it might be. So you can have a lot of fun with the different patterns on this stamp. Again, this is called Pretty in Plaid. And then the last one that they came out with is called Heavenly. Very pretty. So it's all these angels and you have these wings and these wings, you could use these for lots of different projects. Like if you're into fairies or things like that, you could use the wings for that. And here you can see they used it on a dresser. But again, I think that these would make stunning images on cards and then you just, you know, could cut them out. You could do a really cool. Uh, gatefold card, I think. Create flaps with these big wings and then put something in the center. So there are the stamps. And then last, I got the transfers. And the transfers, I think I sold out of these first last year. They went, again, really fast. And once they're gone, they're gone. This one, I can't even get the whole thing into the camera, so I'm going to tilt it here on the side, so I apologize. But, uh, yeah, look at it. It's just really neat. It's 12 by 16, so that's why I can't get it all into the camera. But look at all the neat different designs that you get. Aren't those cool? I love all of them. And then here's, there's more. This So that's the other sheet that you would get. I have a feeling these are going to go super fast too. I love these. It's called Christmas Valley. And you could create just gorgeous wall art with these. You could do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Create like eight wall art uh, things. It, these would even be neat. You know those wooden planks that you can get at the Dollar Tree? You could glue some of those together and attach these on those wooden planks and create some beautiful wall decor. I might do that. Again, though, <laughs> it depends on if I can get one for myself, which I hope I can because I'm going to offer them to all of you first, and then if they have extras, you know, I will keep one for myself, but I have a feeling that these really are going to go fast. And then the other one is a paint inlay. And again, you can create just gorgeous uh, wall art or furniture with these. If you just have like a cabin and you want some winter decor, it doesn't even have to be Christmas, you know, it could just be winter with some of this. I love, look at the gingerbread. Baked fresh every day, the gingerbread. Isn't that neat? These are so, I mean, just all of them. Everything that they came out with is just amazing. I love it all. That is the latest release from Iron Orchid. I do have limited product in stock right now, ready to ship out. I do plan on doing another order because I have a feeling these are gonna go really fast. Once I place my order, I think it takes, at the most, a couple weeks to get my order in. And that's, you know, usually it's within a week, but sometimes it takes a little longer. I do have limited stock available, ready to ship out. If you see anything, again, I would grab it quickly because I can't stress this enough. Once they're gone, they're gone. I have people going, do you have used ones? And I even have sold my used ones at times. So yes, if you see anything you like, run and grab it while you can. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave me a message. And I will be back 
again really quick to continue our project that we started which was the travel journal hybrid that I was working on and I do have the video with the cards I'm going to show you how to make those as well and I have some new products coming from a new company and so I plan on showing those Hopefully soon. They're coming from the UK, so it might take a little time for me to get them do a pre-order just to make sure that I order enough so when they're here, they're ready to ship out. That is it for today's video. I will be back very soon, like I said, to continue our project of our journal working with the Sweet Sentiments collection and then the cards. I also will be sending out the update with the patterned uh, damask print and then the mirrored images for your flaps that will be sent out hopefully today if not tomorrow and I also plan on doing some tags for the collection as well so be on the lookout for those updates all right thank you everybody thank you so much for watching if you haven't subscribed be sure to subscribe so you get the latest notifications I still have some mystery boxes I went ahead and I purchased more so I could do more mystery boxes and those have been a hit you can find some influencers out there or people who have purchased it that show kind of similar items that you might find in the mystery box it changes the stuff's different, so if you want to order more than one, you could get a second one and you'd have completely different items. There is a few more of those left for those of you who were interested and still want those. We'll catch you back soon. Thank you again for watching.